Hello, my name is Errol and welcome to another Devs and Errol review. We are here to review uh, the new Sherlock Holmes Game of Shadows Errol. and stuff. Amanda! Hey, come, 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 come in. Let's go sit, sit, sit here. What? Sit, sit. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. And unfortunately, Debs is not here actually, so we're gonna have Manda. We could, I can, I, we could call her Debs if Aaron, you want. what are you doing here? I'm, I'm, I'm we're, we're doing a review of a movie. It's gonna be awesome. This is my apartment. How yeah, you, 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 you don't mind, do you? I just have that ability. Okay, just, you're doing great. So, this is the camera, and we're, you, you, remember, you saw, you saw the new Sherlock Holmes, right? Uh, yeah, I did. It's awesome, right? You liked it, did you? Right? Okay, so we, I, we're doing movie reviews oh. for my website, okay, um, the Debs and Arrow website. We're gonna have to have a serious talk after about the, about going, into about going to another thing? movie? Yeah, we could go together to a movie. That'd be awesome. We could be serious about going to a movie together. Which which one haven't you seen yet? Have you seen Mission Impossible? I haven't seen that one yet. So if you want to go see it, I also haven't seen. Oh, the new Tintin movie. I haven't seen that as well. You know what? Let's let's just review. Let's just one. Get this okay, over okay, right we'll now. do that one first, so, and then we can go to the other ones. And that because are you busy tomorrow? No, I actually I'm busy. I work. Oh, you do? Yeah. I'm well, not during the day. I'm at at night. Yes. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, well, we'll find a day. I, I can get, you have, I, I'll get my iPad, we'll schedule it. Okay, just, Maybe Tuesday. You don't have a key or anything, right? No, 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 your windowless one. So anyway, we're going to do, um, did you see the first one? Uh, I did. I liked it, actually. It was, I, I, I enjoyed the too. first one. It was, it was kind of a good reinvention of the character. It was a good... And I like Sherlock Holmes. I've read all the, have you, do you like Sherlock I'm Holmes? I'm not actually, I don't know the canon that You don't know any, well. you don't know, so you, you haven't read any of the books or the short stories? No, did I Did you play the old Infocom game? Text game? No. No, it was awesome. It was kind of awesome. No. It actually, even, it was really hard at the beginning. I remember you walk in and, and Holmes, because you play as Watson, and, yeah. and Holmes is like in some sort of, uh, some kind of like um, cocaine stupor. Okay. And, so, and the only thing that, that really gets him going is if you hand him a newspaper so that he sees something in the newspaper. And, he, and it was great because the old Infocom games were awesome because they gave you all sorts of stuff. So you got like the newspaper and in the newspaper what they had is they had the they had the tide schedule. And tide schedules are very important it seems in like a lot of text games. So that really? you can, Yeah. So that you can find out to go to a certain point in time when the tide is low so that you can find stuff. Anyway, you wouldn't really know about that unless you had the tide schedule from I didn't, the I didn't play that game. I didn't no. play okay. the text game. I did, however, I played uh, one of the uh, adventure games, the one of the more recent ones that came out. Oh, which from one? Frogware. It was uh, Frogware. Sherlock Holmes versus Jack the Ripper. That oh, the oh, is that thinking. good? Oh, actually, yes. you reviewed it, right? Yeah, it's that? actually. Like, you I liked it. Know. Was it a good review? It was. It was good. Yeah, I. It was, good it was good. actually one of those games I was expecting to go in and not enjoy, but oh, I did. Oh, really? Why? Because you don't like Sherlock Holmes or Jack well, the Ripper or I, Victorian area. I just area? saw that and I was like, Do you like, remember oh. from Fantasy Island when uh, no. the guy came in? I'm just gonna stop you right there and say no. I don't. Do you know what Fantasy Island is? Not really. No. Cutter Montalban and Tattoo, and one guy, his his uh, goal in life was to solve the Jack the Ripper. Kate, you don't oh. know what I'm talking about. <laughs> you don't know what Fantasy Island is. Oh, okay. What were we talking about now? Uh, yeah, what were we talking about? We were talking about, about adventure. No, we weren't talking about. We're talking we're about talking you, Game of the Shadows. movie. We're trying, yeah, Game of Shadows. You can start. <laughs> okay. Um, I didn't like it. You didn't like <laughs> it? Oh, you didn't. You wanted to review it, didn't you? What well, do you mean you didn't like it? This what? is my review. Oh, okay. okay. You didn't like it. Well, okay. okay. I, I, I I'll, thought it was I'll fun. It's not that I hate I didn't hate it. I didn't be like, oh, God, this is a travesty to all movies. No. I. It was okay. Hey. Just okay. It was just okay. I mean, it only got like what sixty percent on Rotten Tomatoes. Yeah, and I went. It was just. I think there, with me, there was just a bit. One, there was just a bit too much of everything. Yes. In other words, um, it's like how many times do you have to show me the inner workings of a gun? Really? That's true. <laughs> or I think like, like oh, that yeah. that whole movie would be about half an hour to forty minutes shorter if. They took out all the slow mo yeah. uh, transitions and whatnot. Yeah, it's um, like watching Mission Impossible two, and John Woo got a hold of it with his doves and his slow motion. <laughs> that was crazily slow. Did you see Mission Impossible two? Um, Do you know who John Woo is? I know who John Woo okay. is. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. There yeah a lot of slow motion transitions. The other thing was that I, I've kind of been spoiled a bit with um, with the BBC series Sherlock. Oh yes. I don't know yes. if you've seen it. Have no, seen everybody it? keeps telling me. I'll lend it to you because I have. Yes, I know. I saw that. <laughs> I did see it there, and I was thinking, I want to borrow this! Uh, and I just, like, I... I That's why I'm here, because I know you had a whole whack of cool stuff, 
And so I came here because I wanted to borrow stuff. Anyway, you were going to say something. Oh, uh, no, no, yeah. Like, I, I watched that about a year ago. I started watching it. I bought it because I wanted to buy Doctor Who, but it was, they were each $80. And, $80. And Sherlock was cheaper and by the same writer. And I was like, okay, sure, why not? And it's only three episodes long per season. Well, there's a fourth season now, right? Or a fourth, second season. Six, whatever, fourth yeah. episode. But, uh, yeah, and I just watched the new episode and it was... Amazing. Fantastic, and then right after that, I went and saw Sherlock Holmes: uh, The Game of Shadows, and I was like, I just, I, in terms of Sherlock's, like, if I'm considering, I consider that kind of the superior one, even though it's not in Victorian England, even though. Did it's, you ever see the Jeremy Brett version? So I, I know, but I hear he's like the quintessential. Yeah, Holmes. Yeah, he's really yeah. good, and I think I really like him because he's not as uh, kind of autistic as Sherlock is with um, what's his mm -hmm. name? What's you know. Oh, Robert Eddie Jr. Yeah, thank you, thank you. <laughs> I, don't know how I forgot it, just complete blank. I was about to say. Anyway, but he's very, he's not, you know, because, you know, a lot of older films would usually portray Watson as completely bumbling yeah. at Holmes Normal. So, I think Jeremy Brett, you could see that he was a little bit off kilter and Holmes, um, and Watson was normal. And Watson so, was, yeah, Watson was still sharp. I like yeah, that about mm -hmm, the movie. He yes. could, he could, fi he could hold his own, he could figure mm -hmm. things out, he could, Take out the big cannon and yes. shoot things. By the way, how spoiler is this going to be? Oh, oh, because <laughs> uh, there's there's certain spoilery things. I don't think that... we should do it because it's too new. So I wouldn't really okay. want to throw any spoilers. In okay, there. I All might right. I might talk about a couple of things, but maybe we could bleep it out. I could just go. Ah! Okay, yeah, no okay. spoilers. I will bleep them out if there are, if there are too crazy of spoilers. <laughs> okay. So, but you could say things like, you know, I don't know, Anakin well, is Darth Vader. Hope no one was. No, I hope no, no one was disappointed by that fact. Luke's father. Um, no, there's like a couple scenes that I don't think are. You know, if you were to see that. Star Wars in order, you will see that Episode Three is like, look, this is Luke and Leia. So that if you didn't know by Episode Five, it's like, I am your father, and it's like you already know. It's like boring. But scene hopefully it. they won't do. One, two, three. Anyway, that's really That spoilers. was another thing, too, because there was a couple of points where Holmes, because they do the, like, where he's calculating how the fight's going to turn out. Yeah. And I do enjoy that. I thought it was just a titch too much of it, but there was also a point where just it got a bit ridiculous. And it's right at the beginning, so it's yeah. not No, that's right. No, it happens. Uh, he closes, he, he's, like, sitting there, and he's closing his eyes, and he's imagining how the fight's going to go. And all I can think was, like, but you don't know this guy has brass knuckles, and you don't know he has a nice stick, and you don't know this. You? Maybe he felt it when he was punching them. You know. <laughs> maybe, maybe dig dug around in their pockets while yeah. they were pummeling him. I don't know. There's but a new review, by the way. I mean, this is a little advertising kind of thing. There's a new uh, witless letter coming out, and I'm in it. He's in it. He, she was gonna punch me in it, but then, <laughs> but then <laughs> that'd be kind of. It would have been cool. <laughs> I didn't see it in 3D either, actually. I refuse to see a lot of movies in 3D. Did you it see depend, it in 3D? Uh, what, the, Although I heard Hugo was really good in 3D, but I still didn't see it in Hugh, 3D. Which, which one? Sherlock Holmes in 3D? Or? Yeah, was, Sherlock, was it in 3D? I I know, which, see, which, 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 Filmed in 3D and made for 3D. No, I, yeah, I agree. If it's a film that's like we're gonna give it a 3D treatment, like all the freaking films that are coming out this year with yes. 3D, I'm, I'm against it. Me I'm... too. So, but it is good. If you've read the book, the book's really good. The Adventures are no, the invention of Hugo Cabret. It's called, oh. and it's really, it's like it's this thick or something like that. Holy crap! Maybe literally, it might be that thick, but it is really thick. And the reason is that there's like almost a picture every page. So I'll take yeah, it gonna, it's really nice. Yes. Um, Game of Shadows. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, uh, speaking of other things I shouldn't be talking about, yeah. um, I keep on talking about the song I'm writing for you. Am I allowed to talk about that, or is that like uh, a surprise? Well, you put it on your podcast. <laughs> so. Yeah, but <laughs> who's listening. going to listen to that podcast? I, my really? has a podcast. Listen to it. <laughs> it's out my song. It's okay, because, uh, no, that's okay. Oh, really? Um, okay. I mean, because nobody's heard the song, unless it was supposed to be this it's big surprise. It's because it's not written yet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll get there. We'll Come get on. There. We have uh, videos and podcasts to do. And comics. Videos. And, yeah. So, my job is to get back to Game of Shadows. <laughs> okay. 
you're doing a good job of keeping me on focus. This, this is, is your awesome. focus. Yes. See? Okay, so we're talking about games. So it's. I did like it though. I would. Say, I like the first one better. Yeah, I like the first one better okay. because I mean there was a lot more mystery about. The first one I felt. Like, yes, yes. There was yes, much yes. more like, I wonder how that happened. And this one was much more about... It's more of a cat and mouse game. Yeah. Which is not a bad thing, which is not but a bad it's not thing. a mystery. But also they took like those few humorous moments from the first one, like how much people love them and everything, and just blew, like, yeah. like let's put 20 of them in instead yeah. then, and or let's fake. And that's probably why I don't like mystery books today, because they happen to be just more like thrillers as opposed yeah. to, right? So that's why I like reading Sherlock Holmes, because yeah. they were mysteries. And, oh, one, one scene I, I did love, and I'm not going to spoil it, but well, I'm we're going to talk about it, and you I'm don't gonna, know. I'm just going to hint at it uh, that I thought was awesome, and I don't know if you agree with me. I don't uh, know what it is it's yet. It's close to the end, I'll just say... It's close to the end! This it's is close to the end, I'll just, say, I'll just say one word. The chair. Oh, he doesn't know! Didn't make that much of an impact then. Near the end? Oh, yes! <laughs> oh, yes! Now I know. That, yes. that I was like, bah! And like, <laughs> and like suddenly, like, because I was sort of feeling like, okay, when's it over? That's awesome! And, uh, <laughs> I enjoyed it. It was, it was fun. Ish, like, I think the Rotten Tomatoes of sixty percent is a good. Yeah, rating. it's a good assessment. It's not like I didn't feel like uh, two hours of my life had been lost. I, it I, was two hours though. It did feel long. I it was did thinking, feel wow, like the two this hours. Is two but hours. I didn't feel like I was robbed of yeah, anything. Yeah. I didn't feel. I try to go on cheap nights anyway. Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, we we saw this in a cheap theater. Yeah. And, um, so, so what are you seeing next with me? I know, Leaf wants, I, I know Leaf wants to go see uh, Dragon Tattoo. Have you read that book? Uh, I haven't read the book. I saw the Swedish movie. Yeah, did you like the Swedish movie? I really liked okay. it. Okay, oh, I yeah. hear that the... Well, what does the ranking on um, the Dragon Girl? It has it's a really high, high one. one. Yeah, yeah, so I want to see that it. one. I want to so. see... I want to see Hugo. That's I good. want to see many things. Yeah, so. yeah, me too. We can see if Leaf is free and we can go see Dragon Girl. Dragon Girl? Yes. <laughs> Do a ticket for Dragon Girl, please. <laughs> Oh, it was really oh, cool. Wait. It was neat because I went to the theater. And I think it was for like it was for Game of Thrones Shadow, and it was neat because I take out I take out my wallet. Okay. And 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 if you've seen my last uh, review with uh, Back to the Future with Debs, she gave me this thing. Did you see the Back to the Future review? Yes, I did. Oh, I just about yeah. to hit you because you didn't. Anyway, th but you did. But this is all good. Thank you. And uh, anyway, I'm taking my out and I'm looking for my scene card. And wouldn't you know? She goes, "Is that is that a Totoro wallet?" And, and I go, yes, it is. And then she goes, oh, I love Totoro. And then we just sit and start talking about Totoro. And then she points to her, like, her name tag. And sadly, I forgot her name. It might have been Sarah. I'm sorry if you're what She's not watching this. Anyway, it said my neighbor Totoro on it and everything, right? So it was oh really it was really fun because we had a little bonding moment. <laughs> yeah, it was when I actually saw Game of Game of Shadows. So there you go. Oh, it's, it's appropriate. It's not it's just random. There is it's there not just in here. random talking. You know, this, is our, this is our first review. Um, and next time I'll <laughs> call you and tell you when you can come to my apartment. Um, Why? But Why? You busy Tuesday? I can just show up. I know where it is now. I don't doubt it. I um, found out. It was great. <laughs> don't ask. But uh, yeah, uh, this is our first one. Next, next couple we do or whatever next week we'll get a better sense of how to pace these things what are you talking <laughs> about it's pacing great scripts <laughs> no, no i don't know what you want to skip it's um, okay we can go see a movie yeah what's new maybe we can go see the dragon tattoo one the dragon tattoo and then we can one? review that one that'd be awesome okay and then we can ask leaf to see it with I'm glad us we're, i'm glad we're planning this out <laughs> on video so that and then the we'll ask leaf knows. and then and then we'll review that we'll one. ask leaf leaf will be like mm -hmm. No, he's going, I'm so tired, and stuff like that. <laughs> Nobody even knows who Leaf is. He's a mutual friend. That's how I know Amanda acts. It's not really how I know Amanda. Amanda came from Debs and Arrow. I know him Arrow. many yeah. things, yeah. yeah. You know a lot of people in Monkey Man Theater, too, yeah. right? Yeah, You have to be in a Monkey Man play, and then I can play at it, and then I'll be excited, because there's... Whoa. I'll point to you. I know her! Woo! I'm the same to you. Yeah. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you very see you much. Next we'll time. see ya. Bye bye. bye. Woo! Thank you, man. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was rough. <laughs> what do you mean that was rough? That was all sorts of awesome. <laughs>